Hello and welcome back guys to my channel. So now I'm going to show you the first game that I ever created and I created it using Roblox Studio. So I started it uh, a month ago with zero knowledge with Lua programming language and zero knowledge with creating 3D models. The game is actually called Campo Campo or in the Philippines called Agawan Base also. So we're in there is two teams. One is the runner team and the other one is the hunter team. So the runner team just need to escape from the hunters. And the hunters need to capture each of the runners players by tagging them or touching the players. Once a runner is touched by a hunter, they will go to the base of the hunter just to simulate of sending the runner as a prisoner once a runner is a prisoner another runner team member can save them by going to the hunter's base and touch them again so that they can escape from the base uh, the game uh, is actually for lasted for 10 minutes so but i'm planning to change it just for five minutes there's actually some objects or items that pops up on the map randomly so there are some objects that's when you touch it can slow you down and some items can give you speed and the other thing is you can get some coins and once you collected enough coins you can buy some stops or items that will boost your speed so like this one and you can also purchase some pets just to boost your wallet because uh, initially once you're in the game you can only get maximum of 15 coins but once you have a pet it can boost up to 30 coins and it can double the coin the value of the coins that you will get from the game okay so to purchase some um, pets just look and see i have a pet here it's called goat but in the Philippines it's called Kambing okay so you can purchase pets once you are in the lobby okay so the game also is simulating night and day so as you can see it's changing from day to night once the game round is finished the all the players will be taken to the lobby so this is the lobby so as you can see there is still some bugs with the game Still hidden, but this one I already fixed. I'm still testing the game together with my friends, so hopefully we can catch all the bugs and all the possible issue, so that uh, every players can enjoy the game. So on my next video, I will show you some of the codes that I use. For this game and some of the assets or the 3d models that I use and maybe give you a brief explanation on how I created this game from scratch and once again thank you for watching this video and if you want to check out the game I will leave the link on the description below and hopefully I can see you on my next video. Thanks a lot guys. Bye.